there's actually a few different ways we can show decimal place value. The first is with models. Let's see if we can figure out what decimal this model is showing. What do you think? Use the place value chart to help you. First, we're going to determine how many this whole is divided into. It's divided into tenths, so we're going to be writing our number in the tenths place. All right, how many tenths do we have? We have two tenths, so our decimal is 0.2. All right, let's try looking at another model. All right, we're gonna use the place value chart again. This hole is broken into hundredths, so the number we're going to put in the hundredths place. How many hundredths do we have? That's right, we have six hundredths. Since we have six hundredths and we have zero tenths, we're gonna put a zero in the tenths place. So our answer is 0 0.06. Now that we've named a few different decimals, let's see if we can draw models of these ones. All right, we have 0.7 or 7 tenths. So I'm going to take my hole and break it into tenths. Then I'm going to shade in 7 tenths. Let's try this one, 0.21 or 21 hundredths. I'm gonna break my hole into hundredths. Then I'm going to shade in 21 hundredths. Now that we've done a few together, let's see if you can identify these decimals on your own. Remember, you can pause this and rewind it if you need more time. This decimal is 4 tenths or 0.4. This model is showing 5 hundredths or 0.05. This model is showing 15 hundredths or 0.15. This model is showing 15 thousandths or 0.015. All right, how'd you do? Find more videos and other information at doodleslearning.com.